New Delhi, as many as 17 bodies and 41 wounded people were transferred to the emergency hospitals facility in Kabul on Friday night with the harm caused by citywide firing into the air, the Tola News reported. As per the report, Taliban fighters fired their guns yesterday, in celebration after receiving unconfirmed reports that Panjshir province had fallen to their forces on Friday. Celebratory gunfire was heard in Kabul amid conflicting reports over the situation in Panjshir Valley where Taliban fighters are fighting rival forces for control of Afghanistan's final holdout province, Tola News reported. Afghanistan crisis, live updates occurred in two certain media reports, more than 300 fighters from both sides have lost their lives during the fighting over the past few days. Yesterday, the Taliban claimed that the province has fallen. However, the Northern Resistance Front has refuted the claim by the Taliban. News of Panjshir conquests is circulating on Pakistani media. This is a lie, said Ahmed Massoud, who is leading the rebels. The capital city of Kabul fell to the Taliban on August 15, prompting a chaotic and deadly exit, which was completed on Monday midnight with the last American soldier boarding a flight out of the country. Meanwhile, as Taliban fighters entered Kabul, executives at Afghanistan's biggest independent TV network had a tough decision to make, stay on air or go dark. Tola kept broadcasting, but like the rest of the country's TV and radio stations, it now faces a tough and uncertain future under the Taliban, whose return has sent fear coursing through the media. With inputs from agencies, I blocked test wire.